Some North Texas businesses are trying to decide if they should change their own mask policies after the CDC changed its guidelines. The CDC now recommends wearing a mask only if you live in a high risk area for COVID. Most of North Texas is not considered high risk. Fox 4's Davidson Tendry here now with more. David. Well, Blake, it's no secret. Small businesses, small businesses have been absolutely devastated by the pandemic. So many issues on their plate, so many decisions to be made. And one of them is that polarizing decision of whether or not to require masks inside their establishments. Now, in most places, new CDC guidelines say those masks can be ditched. Lisa's Soul Food Cafe is a family operated restaurant. The lady has two leg bone plates. We've been in business for 35 years. Lisa Davis's loved ones help her run it. I couldn't do it all by myself. They also help enforce rules for customers, such as wearing a mask while inside. If you don't want to wear a mask, you don't have to, but then I don't have to serve you either. It's no secret. Everything is to go. The pandemic is shifting the way businesses operate from supply chain issues. Food prices. Rah out of the sky to health and safety guidelines. I would call it controlled chaos, you know? New CDC guidance, however, is changing the outlook. If the CDC say you don't have to wear a mask, let's just face it, most people are gonna say, hey, the CDC said you don't have to wear a mask. New guidance says most healthy Americans in places of low community spread can ditch masks. We've seen significant decreases in active positive cases. We've seen significant decreases in hospitalizations, ICU stays. Parkland Center for Clinical Innovation says COVID data in North Texas points toward a manageable stage. Is it safe to say we are pushing toward an endemic? It certainly looks that way. Still, it warns potential new variants might move the needle backwards. There's always the possibility. The CDC says growing immunity because of infections and vaccinations is creating a generally lower risk of severe disease. If the CDC said you don't have to wear a mask and then we turn around and say, well, you have to put a mask on, that could be a problem. So. We're going to weigh our options. Many North Texas businesses are already not requiring masks. We can't complain. We got a community that loves us. But ones like Lisa's. You can insert your car. I just like to do the right thing. Are now evaluating what to do while trying to keep customers happy. Like I said, I don't think it's going to be a problem. I really don't. And employees safe. God has really, really, really blessed us. Dallas County says it's no longer requiring masks except for places like jails, health care facilities and long term care facilities. But remember, um, you know, there was a lawsuit involving Governor Greg Abbott and he was saying that local authorities couldn't have their mask mandates in place. So there's been a back and forth between local authorities and the governor.